Anime Studio Pro has many fantastic features, like smartphones and actions. With all these great tools, people tend to think that a frame-by-frame -frame animation is no longer needed, but in time, you might encounter circumstances where it's still a great option. For example, in this character setup, you can do only half head in body turns. But what if you want a complete body turn without touching your setup? Here in this running animation scene, I added at the end several images to the timeline in a frame-by-frame -frame animation manner so I can achieve the illusion of a complete body turn of my character. This here is another sample of frame-by-frame -frame animation. Personally, I like to complement Anime Studio with another really cool software that I've been using for years. This is Xara Extreme, a very easy and intuitive illustration software to use. Easy is the keyword here. Since frame-by-frame -frame animation is time-consuming, you want to make this task as friendly and easy as possible. Here's the process of creating the illustrations for my frame-by-frame -frame animation in time-lapse. Okay, now we need to bring each image we just did in Xara to Animation Studio Pro. And now it's just a matter of making each image visible only on certain frames of our timeline. At the end, we have placed our character rigged and set up in Animation Studio for further head and body turns, as well as body moves. Okay guys, this is just an approach I found convenient as a complement of Anime Studio Pro for frame-by-frame -frame animation. I hope you find this information useful. Thanks for watching.